Sadly, there's something going on in Nigeria that has cost 30 whole people their lives, and that's the cholera outbreak. Here are five things you need to do to stay safe. Number one is eating food outside. <laughs> now is not the time to eat mama food. I absolutely love abacha, but now is not the time to eat abacha. Hi, editing other here. I didn't explain the abacha properly. Number one is abacha is uncooked. And when I say don't eat abacha, I mean don't eat abacha outside. Back to the video. Because the way cholera is transmitted is through food and water that contains the bacteria called Vibro cholera. So I beg, just try and cook your own food this season. Number two is avoid eating raw fruits and vegetables without washing them. This is not the time for you to buy watermelon and tell the malam to cut it for you so that you can be eating inside the bus as you're going. Mm -mm. You have to wash it properly because you do not know what it has been exposed to. And just adopt it. It's a good thing to wash your fruits before you eat them. Number three is to wash your hands with soap and water frequently. Anytime you get the opportunity, Wash your hand with soap and water. It goes without saying that if you use the toilet, for God's sakes, wash your hand with soap and water. Now more than ever, it's really important and it can save your life. As simple as it is. Number four, if you can boil your water before you drink it. I have not said that you should drink hot water. I say boil your water. You can allow it to cool down before you drink it. Because boiling kills this bacteria, vibro cholera. Number five is the most important point. If you start having diarrhea, that looks like rice water. You know when you finish washing rice, that water that you pour away, it looks like that. My dear, you have cholera. In fact, if you start having any type of diarrhea, rush to the hospital. And on your way inside the car or inside the bus, you're taking ORS. Because the problem with cholera is that you can shit all the water in your body out in few hours. I'm not talking about this. I'm talking about few hours. You can shit out all the water in your body. And your cells and the person, let me not say you, and the person, will cells will literally die of thirst and the person can die having lost all the water in their body share this with people so that they can keep safe so that they can learn in this season follow me if you like content like this thank you so much for watching as always stay healthy and i'll see you in the next video bye